guys. This is your ELA work for the week. Um, it might take you two weeks, it might take you three weeks, um, and it's something that all of you can work on. So I am going to send you the link to this so you'll have it, but I wanted to show you what to do on it. So it's called Reading Strategies Task Cards, and you don't have to worry about that. You come to this um, first page that has these different cards on it. On the side of the card, these ones say author's purpose. So you're gonna read the passage and then you're gonna answer the two questions. What is the author's purpose? Is it to um, entertain, is it to inform, or is it to persuade? So you have three choices here, persuade, inform, and entertain. So you're gonna answer that question and then you're gonna say, how do you know? And you're gonna tell me how you know once you pick it. So that's the author's purpose. Then you have something called connections, and this is an interesting one. So you're gonna read the passage and then they're gonna ask you a question. What does the story remind you of from your own life? So this is text to self. You are connecting it to yourself. On this one, it's the same thing, text to self. It's connecting what's in this information to your own life. But down here, this one is text to text. The question is, what does the story remind you of from something else that you have read? And this one is text to the greater world. What does the story remind you of from the real world? Your next cards are summarize it, which you guys all need work on, um, so do I. So this is great. You're gonna read the passage and then it tells you that you have to summarize it in a certain amount of words. And it looks like you have to summarize all of these passages in 12 words or less, all right? Making sure you have the main ideas. The next one is inference. Remember what inference means in educated guests. So you're gonna read your passage and then it asks you questions. Where was the family going? What makes you think so? So you're inferring something. They're not going to give you the information explicitly. You have to come up with the information based on the paragraph you're reading. So these are inferences. The next four are questioning. So what questions could you ask about this paragraph? So you're gonna read this and you're gonna come up with your own questions that you could ask about this paragraph. That if you were to give to somebody else, that they'd be able to read this paragraph and answer those questions. The next one is predictions. What's gonna happen next? So you're gonna read your paragraph again and it's gonna say what will happen next and what makes you think so. So I think that blah, 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 Jenna's going to da, 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 da. And the reason I think so is because in the passage it said da, 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 da. Um, so you're just coming up with your own predictions. And then they show you a reading strategy task card recording sheet. I don't want you using this because it doesn't give you enough space. It just tells you the date completed. But use a piece of paper and Pete's gonna show you my piece of paper here. So again, you guys know I have my first name, last name, we're doing ELA, reading strategies, and the date, and then I'm just having my number one, and I just keep going until I've answered all 24. So again, this is, something you, this is not something you do in a day. You can hop around, I can go from one and do a little bit of a card. Um, I can do one from one section, and then I can go to another section. You don't have to do them in order. Just make sure you're number, numbering them appropriately so I can see them, and make sure you're using complete sentences when you're answering your questions and then I want to show you one more thing it gives you answers but I don't want you looking at those answers I want you having integrity and the answers are very short they're not very involved they just kind of help you know if you're on the right track please do not look at those unless you're really stuck but I'd rather you text Pete and I or DM Pete and I or call us if you're having trouble so that is your reading strategy on work. And again, you can start that today and you can work on it this week and next week, however long it takes you. Uh, do a couple cards a day, a couple cards a week. Um, just make sure you're taking pictures of your work and sending them to us. If you have any questions, let us know. Happy reading strategies.